और खांसी ओह वट आर यू गैस टॉक इन अबाउट वॉट गोइंग ऑन हियर The way you guys are talking sounds really weird. What is Zeta some sort of monster? Uh, what the fuck? H- how are you floating? Y- you're floating. Uh. <laughs> Kate, is he all right? I'm sure he's fine. I just hope he doesn't remember any of this tomorrow. What should we do? The only thing we can do right now is not is to not panic and make sure he's okay. Here, help me put him on his side. His side? All right. Why put him on his side? He drank too much. It's possible he could puke in his sleep. If he does, we don't want him on his back. Oh. <laughs> yes, that would be horrible. Zeta. So, what's the deal? You and Kate are dating. Why are you hiding it? You both are always together. You're always at his house. Uh, there's no way there's nothing going on between you two. It's so unfair. I finally found someone interesting. And she's taken. You guys have no idea how hard I have it. I never had a girlfriend before, let alone any friends. That's right. I've never kissed before. And I still have my virginity. Uh I know how to socialize, but when it comes to relationships, I don't know what I'm doing. But it's all my fault. <laughs> I never put any effort into it. I thought I could spend all my time focusing on school and jobs to have a happy life. Instead, I live a sad life because I don't know how to make friends. I've sat back and watched others be happy together, but I was fine with that. Nobody caught my interest <laughs> until you both came along. I felt like I could relate with Kate. <laughs> We we're both anti-social. I thought we could become good pals. And Zeta, such a unique look. No one has ever caught my eye like her. But you guys seem like you don't want me in your life. I thought things would be different, but I guess I still can't make any friends. Um, I am so sorry you are feeling so sad. Are you hungry? Well, can we get you something to eat or drink? <laughs> yes, please. Is that oatmeal? No. <laughs> Just try to relax and get some rest, okay? Mm-hmm. Lightweight. <laughs> hey, don't you dare mock me. Such a mess. Are you even going to make it to work tomorrow? You don't even care about my feelings. Maybe it's a good thing we didn't become friends. I brought you into my house, dipshit. Kate, let's all calm down. Rest is what everyone needs right now. And another thing. What's your deal? You guys are so suspicious for no apparent reason. But I know one of your big secrets. Huh? Huh? And I plan to uncovering more. You both better be cautious around me. Ugh, he's one of those friends. I could expose you. He's already on the shit list, but he's about to stay permanently on the shit list. But I know one of your big secrets. And I plan on un- uncovering more. You both better be cautious around me. Huh? Huh? I could expose you. Uh, wait. Is he talking about fake ID or Zeta floating or both I don't want Zeta to be discouraged but I guess it's better if she knows the truth that's right I know what you're hiding you can't keep it from me huh you both are undercover cops aren't you huh uh you both out to get me 
I paid all those parking tickets. I have the receipts and you can't say otherwise. I may throw trash out of my car when I'm driven down the road, but you can't prove that. You gotta be fucking kidding me. You can't prove shit. Uh, then do you remember anything weird that may have happened earlier? Weird, yeah. Why are you guys in my house? Well, that's a relief. If I can't litter, why are you guys allowed to break in? Get some rest, say. Huh. <sighs> what about you? You're not sleeping? As much as I would love to. I gotta make sure our shit-faced guest is okay. Hey, and... We gotta be more careful. We don't need any more people finding out. The less people, the better. Okay? Okay. <sighs> oh. Ugh. You finally sober? What, what time is it? Four in the morning. Four? Four! I have work. Ugh. My head. Here. For your hangover. Go, 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 go. Phew. How did I get here? You don't remember anything? Uh, I joined you and Miss Ada for dinner. Is that all? Yeah. All right, and I drive you home. Let's go. Is Ada here? No. I'm sorry for the in inconvenience I've caused you tonight. Thanks for looking after me. It's whatever. This changes nothing, however. Huh. We're still rivals. Right? <sighs> of course. <laughs> I thought so. Mm, why is she glowing? For a second, I don't know if he's gonna like somehow recall some of the stuff that he did but did witness when he was drunk or doing, you know, uh, his blackout. But I feel like he might recall a bit of stuff. But that's kind of weird that he kind of shift his mm, the way he's, you know. So him and Cade are rivals, and I guess they're competing for Zeta's affection. But now we're seeing Zeta sleeping, but she's glowing. And I'm wondering, I don't recall ever seeing that happen. So what is going on? Another cliffhanger here. But all right, guys, if you guys enjoyed the way I read this webtoon and react to it, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, drop some comments, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!